You can buy a limited selection of bras, Marina. One. There was a story I used to love, Building 19, one of my absolute favorites. Building 19 closed down a few years ago now. More than ever, good stuff cheap. And this store, you may notice, has good stuff cheap. I saw that after they closed down. I wondered, if, is it like a spur of Building 19? Is it somehow related? And I actually reached out to the CEO of Ollie's, asked him, did they have anything to do with Building 19? He says, no, he knew Jerry, talked to him, but they didn't have anything to do with each other. But after it closed down, they bought up the name, Good Stuff Cheap from Building 19. So, as far as I can tell, the font. Yeah, and you can kind of see the art style of Ollie. You'll see that that same idea. It's not the same artist, but the That's same kind concept. Of caricature of yeah. Jerry. Thank you for shopping by Building 19. What the? What did you do? Just email the guy? Yeah, I just emailed him. He was have, very nice. Have you ever shopped here? Never. Never been here. Oh, before. you've never even been inside. No. Let's get some good stuff cheap. Yeah. This was a Building 19 Hallmark, which is to get carts from closed stores. I like these giant planters. $49.99. It feels a lot like Building 19. Yeah, it's Building 19. <laughs> it kind of is. Same concepts. It must be interesting to be a buyer for a store like this. Oh, potato sticks. Those are yeah. from my childhood. Do you like them, Nina? In theory? I mean, I, I like that they exist. <laughs> I, I barely remember them. <laughs> you're, you're home. Yeah, I'll show you. Beef gravy. Beef gravy. I'm going to buy some beef gravy. Good value on spices for a, a dollar, but they're very big containers. Bigger than those state job lots. Spice up your life. <laughs> Every boy, every girl. Spice up your life. Spice up your life. You love the world. It's good price on oyster crackers. And that is the brand, the best. Nina loves them. I, I bet. I love them too on chowder. But she just eats them. They just individually came up with this kitschy idea to put cartoons of themselves everywhere. <laughs> no, I think that the salvage stores were definitely a concept. You buy up local, regional salvage merchandise. Yeah. And then, then you yourself. put cartoons of yourself on Yeah, the what's place? the cartoons got to do that with everything? <laughs> I don't know about that one. Prices that are generally better than uh, Ocean State Job Which I guess would be their number one competitor at this point. The only thing is big at a time that Ocean State wasn't. Ocean State was a really small time operation. Now, they're, of course, they're huge. Marie Callender's baking mixes. Names I know in configurations <laughs> I could never have imagined. Brownie muffin. Like, not even just a muffin or a brownie. You're not going to start off simple introducing your brand. Bone fat honey bun or cornbread. I mean, that sounds pretty good. Look how cute this is. If I had a slightly older child, this yep. is just adorable. That is super cute. I don't think you could have done a proper supermarket shop at Building 19. It looks no, like you might be able to sort of cobble one together here. No, no refrigerators, probably. A couple of Building 19s had freezers where they have, like, really weird ice cream but most of them just had food like this, which is, you know, dry goods. And look, cheap <laughs> mattresses, too. Aw. Uh -huh. There's nothing like an $8 blanket in there. Yeah, so artificially, wonderfully soft. I love slippers. Yeah? And I go through them pretty quick. Pretty nice stuff for a 97 cent square foot. We got Pergo at Home Depot, and it was very cheap. Some of us can't go for Pergo. We gotta go a little cheaper than that. <laughs> we gotta go for luxury vinyl wood flooring. The thing about vinyl is you can get it fully wet, and it doesn't matter. That's what I have in my bathroom. I have vinyl. I like it because it's not cold, either. I like it because I can lean on it too. You know what? <laughs> He's right. And I've got like double support here. I can lean up a little, you know. For when your oh. dogs pee on the carpet. And they're like, hey, we acknowledge that like dogs are part of life. We'll yeah. clean up after them. Yeah. Spot bot pet. Spot bot pet. Spot bot pet. What if your pet is named Spot? And then, Spot left a spot on your carpet and now you need the Spot bot pet to remove the spot that Spot left. It's the Spot Spot Whoa. pet bot. Nina, always looking for a good area rug. I love a area rug. I'm gonna put it in front of my sink in the kitchen. Oh, it's beautiful. Do you find another spot to lean on over there? John's very supportive of my personal oh, I am. And that bed's very supportive of him. Isn't it weird that this rug would have this weird tortoise shell pattern? Here, yeah, let's look at just... some under rugs. Oh, yeah, yeah. And if you don't like that color, there's this color. Eight by tens. Good stuff, cheap. Pretty good, pretty cheap. I want to stay with you. This is something I've never seen anywhere but I've mentioned it here. It's tall, tall rugs in these rugs. You can see the original factory too. Whoa. <laughs> this is kind of like the meat ends that John likes to buy at Market Basket. <laughs> 179 for the whole thing. Look how big it is. It's well, 12 by 22 and point, this could have done the entire studio. There's like a clearance section at all. All right, let's go check it out. I found the free coffee. Oh, there's, they do the free coffee thing here too? Bloody rip off. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. Did they actually have free coffee? Oh yeah, totally. They had this weird little station and my dad would always stop and get like just these regular white styrofoam cups and walk around with coffee that had probably been sitting there for hours. Because on the sign, they're making fun they're of They're making fun of like how it's bad it's gross, it Yeah, but coffee. they always had it. It was a staple of like you can get free coffee. You gonna have some, you know? Yeah, but this is why I don't buy that Ollie and Jerry weren't in bed together. There's no way that they just independently came up with this coffee the, coffee. The pot's always on. Have a free cup of coffee on us, and if you like 
use two sugars. It's been a pretty good year. Our profits are stable enough that you can go ahead and, and have two sugars. sugars. But they don't yeah. have individual sugar packets. They've just got this giant Enjoy brand. Yeah, have two of those. Do you need one of these banana candies? I haven't seen these in a long time. A smushed box of Special K pastry crisps. When Matt comes to visit, I like to have Matt foods where I can just kind of give him a food. That's genius, actually. Uh, like, here, have some Special K pastry crisps to the strawberry flavor. Yeah. All right, Nina, take a sip. Ah. It's actually not bad. They've kind of hidden it in the back of the store. It's yeah. It's weird, like they don't really want me to have it. Get these Corona headphones that are missing mic. Okay. Six ninety nine. dollars also very much like this uh, cheap. This is something my daughter would enjoy and it kind of makes me want to use it like she would use it, like. <laughs> Chaotically and with no mouth, particular purpose. And like rub the back of my head with it and then like forget about it. This is it's just a very kind of small styrofoam cup and it makes me feel like I'm walking around with the cup of Coke from Moritz. Fill this with Coke, no ice. I feel like I'm doing it as a lark, but I'm really just gonna drink this coffee. Yeah, this is Ollie's Follies. This pattern right here is the one that I ripped up from the kitchen in my apartment in 2014. And it's one that we used just a square of in 10 pounds when we needed inserts of him weighing himself. Here's your mattresses. You can't really do much cheaper than this. You know? Mid-century. Very careful. Very sensitive. These are those bamboo stay cool pillows. Why pay good money to see the ruins of Pompeii when there's an Ollie's outlet near you? <laughs> yeah, it's this weird self-deprecating humor that I don't believe just naturally evolved when we sell discount goods. I'm a huge peanut butter M&M &M fan. These are like six fun size packs for 79 cents at good price. Very good price. You're gonna get some. How about one of these? Eight bucks warheads. of warheads. I was pretty much the warhead champion on the school bus. You know, the kids that would get paid to stick a bunch of warheads in their mouth and survive. You can do it. At the office candy bowl, peppermint patties don't move as fast. <laughs> yep. But they do move. Yeah. So if you want to kind of like temper like the consumption rate. You candy bars? Look, I am a huge fan of Yoohoo, so I'm gonna have to try these. The drink. Yeah, the drink. John, you're buying like plenty. Yeah, I've got a few items. Just look at this giant bag of horrible wedding quality pillow mitts. They're, they're probably not good. I've got orange slices that I'm probably <laughs> gonna get because I love these and they're hard to find. Two seventy nine. dollars Are you sure you don't want to stock up? Hey, there's only one. How about some tea fall? <laughs> <laughs> what do you got? It's like super crumbly. These are bad. Oh, it's bad things. things. They Mess. sparkle and fizz. And they're bad for your skin and eyes and genitals. Oh my. Oh, jeez. This is actually mostly because the kid sits on the kitchen floor at my feet while I wash dishes. He shows up there too. How much? Nine bucks. Nine bucks. Nine bucks. Good yeah. price. Can I just say, you thought Building 19 was gone. <laughs> it's still there. A slightly more modernized, a slightly better run. Very slightly. With a little less like pure junk, but otherwise, yeah, pretty much. All right, John, try your Yoohoo okay, bar. I got a Yoohoo mini bar. It's just a chocolate bar. It's fine. Just like milk chocolate. Yeah, it's just milk chocolate. Well, what did you expect? Something a little more Yoohoo flavored, maybe? Like more like the, the drink? Yeah, and it does have a little bit of that as it's coming through now. Yeah, it's pretty good. I like it. All right then. Uh,